Okay, so here it goes. This is going to be episode number 14. This is going to be the finale of the 1 to 20 Tarkov uh, factory only challenge. It's been a pretty big blast. We've had a ton of fun in the last few episodes with the event that's going on. Massive amounts of damage and kills and everything. We're doing pretty good. We're only 21,000 XP away. I figure this is easily achievable in this episode. I'll see you guys at the first get. Okay, so for raid one, just like I was talking about earlier, I did decide to go with an SVD. We managed to get a 100 HP one for not too, too much off the flea market. And uh, we got a couple mags for it. We're rocking the BT ammo. Hopefully we can just one tap people to the chest with this and it goes okay. See you guys in there. Okay, here we are, raid number one. We got the SVD. It's just a scav. There's someone on the top floor. Close the door, I think. <laughs> Fucking hell, I didn't... I thought I would have heard him if he jumped up on that. He scared the shit out of me, bro. Level 35, Glock 17. Fair enough. Ah. Fucking hell, that made zero audio on his creep up. Well, GG, man. Fair enough, I guess. Okay, so we just picked up our dailies. They actually just reset after that raid. We've got six PMC kills on factory for 3,800 XP. Should be uh, pretty easy to get to, I think. We've got Find a tech manual. We already have that. It's a free 3000 XP. And then we've got nine PMCs using SMGs or shotguns anywhere, which I assume is going to be on factories. So I was going to take it to 5.7. We're going to swap that around to something else. I'll see you guys at the second kit. Okay, so for raid number two, we're bringing in just a basic little level four armored rig. We're bringing in some Magnum this time. We've been using flush out a ton. So we'll swap it up a little bit. We need nine PMC kills and six PMC kills. So it should be pretty good. See you guys there. Here's raid number two. We got a shotgun. We got some dailies to try to finish. We got to kill some people. Okay, no one spawned right there. Or at least they didn't immediately walk out if they did. in there looting the safe. I think he saw me there. Anything juicy in them cabinets, boy? Bro, I found 900 rubles, some matches, and the D battery. Hey, that was cool. everything that was in here. I mean, I'm not done looking at the cabinet. You want to split? Hit the same. Oh, guy. No, it's okay. They're they're over by Skybridge. Be careful. Yeah, yeah. Be careful. Be careful. Fuck! There's two of them. I killed one. Ow. Wait. Are y'all on? Yeah. There's. Well, kind of. Yeah. There's another guy on Skybridge. Careful. Careful. I think he's around Raptors, Yeah, he is. You about got one I got him. I got the guy off Raptors. We're good. Let's go. Good job, boys. Go get your loot. I won't mess with you. the hall. All I got is a double barrel. I'm running like a broken. Dude. Around. Yeah, alright. I'm. <laughs> I gotta kill these guys, though. I, I need it for the task. I need a guy on like <laughs> Oh, the guy. I gotta kill him. Okay, well, the guy who died Raptors is like. The guy on Raptors is hitting the gritty right now. I'm so sorry. You have to die for my quest. 34. That fucking broke both of my legs. Some bullshit. I, I just want to say that. I guess it's karma for 
murdering him after he was just spectating the man doing the gritty. He's level eight. Oh no. I hope he understands. Okay, so raid number three. We're gonna take in the 153 once again with some Magnum. We got some secondary flechette since we ran out of Magnum and it's not on the flea anymore. See you guys there. Okay, here we go. Raid number three. We got the shotgun again. We're looking for PMC kills and just general XP. I've been stalking this guy for so long. He's gonna like extract with a fucking factory exit key somewhere. Finally, man. Jesus Christ, bro. Like, <laughs> I was following this guy for so long. Oh, it was a level 11. Okay, so raid number four. Once again, bring the shotgun back in. Still got the magnum. We picked up some more magnum off that guy too. So we got magnum and flechette as the refills, depending on which one we're feeling like. See you guys there. Okay, here we go. Raid number four. We got another shotgun. He's fucking juiced. Back up. That was nasty. Like, jumps down. GG, man. Alright, we can dip out here. I think there might be one more PMC in, here, in there that we heard talking, but... Okay, raid number five. We're going back in with the shotgun. We snagged a new uh, basic rig and all that. We're going to keep it pretty cheap here. Uh, we need... Four more PMC kills, and we need to survive three more raids to get all of our quests finished up, and that gets us well and beyond the XP for level 20. Finish it out the series. See you guys in the raid. Here's raid number, I believe, five? We got a shotgun again? We need uh, four more PMC kills. I'm gayer than you are today. Did he say, it's a me, I'm gayer than you are? Is that what he said whenever he ran around? We saw a guy down there. Arm stam is doomed, but if I let it go, no, I'm right here. Fucked me a little bit, not too bad though. You think it wasn't a VOG? Is this a good nade? <laughs> We're both very dedicated to this. He missed the grenade! It went forward! It sounded like it went behind me! Fuck me, I cannot believe he survived that though. I shot two shots dead on him. 772... <coughs> Expecting that we did 440 to the first guy, or just about, that dude took 330 damage only. Okay, raid number 6, we're bringing in the other guy's gear set. We did manage to get a P90 in between the stuff, and 3 mags for it off the flea market. So we're doing pretty good. It's all loaded up with flesh ammo. We're trying to just evaporate someone at the ankles. That's the current objective. I'll see you guys there. Okay, raid number 6, we got the P90, the juice, we're ready, we're gamer, and we have the absolute chad mentality. Let's get it done. Fucking grenade at me from there.
There's someone back there. I seen the guy who threw the grenade at me. No fucking idea where he's at. That guy. Is that a PMC? It was. Okay, Scott. I saw just a scav, just a scary scav. Tequila! <laughs> Fucking Tequila headshot me. Dude, he shifted and I whiffed on his leg because of it. <sighs> and there it goes, the P90 kit done to a head of ears. Okay, so raid number seven, we're bringing in an MPX, nice and silenced and everything. We've loaded all the way up with rip ammo. Spent like 200k just on the ammo here. We're wearing the Tagila army we got from a couple of raids ago. We're ready, we're gamering. Let's go, see you guys there. All right, here we go, we're going in. We got the MPX. So we know someone's towards extract, we know about this guy right here. <laughs> Fucking hell, man. He just eats it. Fucking, ugh, I couldn't hit him in the legs all the way because the goddamn railing. I okay, so raid number eight, we got an M30 super, and we're coming back with the rip slugs. We got to one-shot someone with these. <laughs> we have to. It has to happen. I have to kneecap someone. They have to fold. But yeah, I'll see you guys in there. Hopefully, we get this. We need two more PMC kills. Okay, here we are with, I believe, raid number eight. We got the rip rounds. We have a mission, and it's to fucking wipe someone's leg out. That's it. Would you try out Tarkov IRL if some absolute insane maniac would make it exist? Uh, no, probably not. The the risk reward factor is really fun with the fact that I do respawn. Um, and uh, I'm not religious enough to think I respawn. So that's like kind of where that fallen happens. If you had a respawn option, fuck it, yeah, probably. To be honest. Like, I don't know, it'd be a fucking experience I've never seen before. One shot to the kneecap! He took my fucking kill, the little shit. We got him! <laughs> I think we stomached this guy. I think we tagged him. No, no shot. He would have died to the stomach. We must have hit him in the packa. And it's just as goddamn happy as I thought I was gonna be about it. Come here. Get a tequila mask. Fair enough, man. Fair enough. Hit him. Are these player scavs? Nah, these are PMCs, I think. There's two of them, though. Ah! 
That's another one! I whipped all of the first shots. But that last one, straight to the fucking kneecap, full HP yoinked him. Level 15. Oh, now we can take that dude's mask, too. Rip slugs do a lot better if you don't miss, I do have to admit. If I didn't whiff on that, you would have died instantly. Kills, two of them that we were looking for. Almost got three. 3,000 XP in total. Nice. The fucking... Both of them got shot to their left leg. Good fuck, nerds. Okay, so for raid number nine, that's kind of a little bit of a meme. We're running the STM. We got him. We got him kitted out. He's got the big boy flashlight on it. He's got one round of GT ammo in the chamber. We're going to take that out. But uh, yeah, he's loaded up with a Quake Maker. We got a second mag of Quake Maker and then some normal GT. Some GT to fill it out. See you guys there. Okay, here we go. Raid number nine. We got the STM. The little little bullet shooter. I guess it's all guns, eh? Only one- no, twice. I think I've survived twice with sunglasses before. I think it's just a scav. We missed. I had to shoot fast though because I didn't want him to kill me. And the scav fucked up my spot, bro. We didn't miss, it just didn't... Just didn't blood splatter, we killed the fuck out of him. Okay. <laughs> oh yeah, the PM pistol! <laughs> I thought I missed. I guess not. I guess I headshot him. I just thought it was gonna fucking... I thought it, I would have seen the blood. That's not tequila, right? That's just a normal scav? It's just normal scab. I thought he was wearing red for a second. I was like, wait, is that the boy? You heard something in here. What the fuck, man? Alright, scab with the fucking instantaneous reaction time. I guess we have to back now. Hop out. Okay, I guess we'll just take the survival. I guess we killed someone with it. Well, it's not that bad. Simple raid, 2.6 thousand. Alright guys, we're going in for the very last raid. We're taking the SA-58 that we got from the Absolute Juicer earlier. We got a U-Lock, we bought a nice armored rig, we have 18,000 rubles left. Doesn't matter, last raid anyways. If we survive this raid, that finishes up all of our quests and we, uh, we are well and beyond level 20. I'll see you guys there. Okay, here it is, the final raid. Play sounds using channel points? Oh god. Someone's literally right here. What the fuck, Scav? My arm! Why? And it tanked it too because I'm shooting fucking M62, so it didn't do enough damage on the first shot. I tried to conserve ammo there, and I really quickly realized why the fuck am I doing that. <laughs> and so I mag dumped him. Tarky nade pin sound. Oh god. I will, you know, I will look into it. I'm not actually sure if I can get that done. 
I don't know if you can do audio stuff with uh, channel points. I know you can do that with bits, so I don't see why you couldn't do it with channel points. This will this will have to be looked into. Yeah, maybe we do some tarky noises. He, his tank helmet took a fucking M62. What a chad. He might have died to the scav earlier. Wait, this guy died to another PMC. I tried to hit tab and I hit grave and then I fucking opened my console. So he was just sitting there menacingly somewhere. Okay, we're claiming the quest now to finish off the XP to hit our level 20. There's level 20. We'll see how much extra we get here. And there it is. We end this series. 140 raids, 65 survived. So we have a 46% survival rate. We have managed to kill 100 PMCs exactly, and we've only died 74 times. That is a clean increase in our PMC KD. I will take it. We've ended at 350,640 XP. I will put the average of the total XP per raid on screen right now. And now I will cut to me going and I will have all of the dog tags sorted and counted. So we'll see how many dog tags I have there. Okay, so after sorting all of the dog tags and counting all of them, we have managed to completely clean it to a 10 by 10 square of dog tags. We have exactly 100 PMC dog tags with the 100 PMC kills. So some of these we didn't kill, we just picked up and acquired. But it's funny that it perfectly works out. I'm going to go and finish up the outro now. I'll see you guys there. Okay guys, that's going to be it for me. That's the end of the finale. I know the last raid wasn't quite what I wanted it to be. I wanted it to be a nice full lobby wipe, but we, uh, we got styled on by the shotgun. I hope you guys really enjoyed the last like five episodes or so. The event was amazing. I hope that the PvP centric stuff made up for the fact that my earlier bits in the series weren't as PvP heavy as I wanted them to be because I wanted to make sure I got uh, XP progression. I really appreciate all the support I got on these videos. Um, I've gotten like 880 views as of doing this outro and everything on the stream. I've just streamed for 8 hours and 40 minutes to finish up these last episodes and everything. I've just spent like 6 hours editing. I fucking, I super, I, I'm super happy about it. I appreciate all the comments. I've been getting likes on all of the videos. It's fucking absolutely massive. I like watching the number go up. Makes the dopamine button get hit every single time. I fucking, um, yeah, this is going to be the end of my first Tarkov series. I plan on doing more of these in the future. Uh, I don't know if they'll all be challenge series or whatever, but I think it's a very fun thing. I have a, I have a ton of fun editing these. You guys will probably be seeing some league content. I think I'm going to plan on doing that soon. Um, as the preseason, I'm going to be messing with it more now that I finish up with the Tarkov thing. And then we'll also definitely have some startup wipe content that happens. And I expect wipe to be around uh, Christmas time, like usual. So yeah, I really appreciate all the support on the series. It was fucking massive. And yeah, I, I just, I hope you guys have a great day. Thank you so much for watching. I hope to see you around. Okay, so just a little after credits thing. 737,000. All right, we got roughly... 860,000 rubles from the dog tags for anyone who's curious. Thank you so much.